Hey guys, Rob again, and I've just got my little 130X out, and uh, if you've seen my previous video, you'll see that I fixed the tail servo. It was just a uh, loose wire that had come um, loose from a fairly bad solder joint, but uh, yeah, it's flying really well now. Um, I've made a couple of adjustments too. I've put the um, canopy grommets on the actual swash plate. Um, linkages and the existing rubber grommet that was on the swash plate linkage I've put on the tail and it's uh, removed all the slops so it's flying really really well and uh, also I've played with the um, throttle curves a little bit I've just got a flat 85% throttle curve for idle up so uh, that's enough for the aerobatics that I do and uh, the helicopter is not just screaming overpowered like it does on 100% which I certainly don't need that power and the battery tends to last a little bit longer so uh, anyway it's enough talking I'll, uh, I'll give it a fly The other thing I've done is I've put a fairly low um, throttle curve just in normal mode so it's just nice and gentle to fly around when it's on this uh, normal mode. This certainly handles well. Now I'll flick it to uh, idle up. That's 85% and it's certainly got enough power for any aerobatics that I'm capable of. And the beauty is the battery lasts uh, for four and a half minutes easily. It's lost all of its um, wobbling tendency since I put those canopy grommets on the swash linkages. This is, uh, shows it's basically got the same problem as the MCPX where the linkages are just a fraction loose and the fly barless, the fly barless system just uh, overcompensates. I hope the lighting's okay there, it's just got a pretty dark grey background. But yeah, it flies really nicely. Feels a lot more locked in now. Walking out to the sunshine, maybe you can see it a bit better in a bit of sunlight. The tail's starting to have a little bit of a wobble. I don't know if it was just hovering in that particular direction in the wind, inverted. It is a little bit windy at the moment, but I just hope that servo is not coming loose. The wire on the servo, I mean. That's in frame. Feels really nice on an 85% throttle curve, it's just enough. And as you can see, it's just still fully capable of, of anything I'm capable of. That's in frame. Got to make sure I move my head accordingly. And if you saw that tail just move out a little bit, then <laughs> a little bit disoriented then. Definitely rolls really nice. Try a left hand roll. 
Alrighty, that's enough. There's the timer. I'll bring it in for landing. Back to normal mode. I'll try and catch it. Ah, it's just a bit windy. I won't try and catch it. Thanks for watching, guys.